Tommaso Nation, check out this new bike by Tommaso. It's the Tommaso Classic. We've been very excited about this bike, and let's go over it, and I'll tell you why. For starters, we have a nice steel fixie frame done in a root beer metallic paint, and we even went with the old Tommaso logo for some of those who remember some of our earlier bikes from the late 80s and 90s. Steel frame with a one inch quill steel fork, nice traditional offset here, lug fork, quill stem, and we actually went with a replaceable faceplate on this. That gives you the option of switching out bars quickly without having to unwrap the handlebar wrap and go through all this trouble. If you want to put a straight bar, a riser bar, bullhorn, two bolts, quick switch, and you're done. We have a nice leather Tommaso branded tape up here. Like I said, a one inch quill coming through the frame. 15 millimeter bolts front and rear to keep those wheels nice and secure. Nice Tommaso 46 tooth crank here. Nice stylish touch. And we went with our usual setup of having a flip flop hub. What's nice about these hubs for starters is they're high flange bearing hubs, seal bearing hubs. And then we have a 16 tooth freewheel on one side and then the 16 tooth fixed gear. So you can try either way. Fixed gear riding is a lot of fun. Uh, the purest sense of riding some people feel. You can race track with it. But if you want to put some brakes on the bike and just drill front and rear four brakes, you can try the freewheel side. That means you can coast. In the fixed gear mode, if the pedals are moving, the wheel's moving. If you put on the freewheel side, then you can coast. Some people may enjoy that more. If you're new to fixie riding, you can kind of try both ways and see which way suits you best. Like I said, this bike's all about fun uh, and looking good and enjoying the ride. The wheels on this, we took a lot of time to get this blue powder coat right to match with the nice decals on the frame. So 36 spoke wheel, nice and sturdy. It's not going to let you down. The high flange hubs, stainless steel spokes. We go up to our uh, 27 two seat post with a really cool suede saddle on this. Um, once again, another classic touch. That's what this bike's all about. Looking good, riding well, and just having a lot of fun. It's a really simple bike, but we took the style to the extreme, and we think you're really going to enjoy this bike.